What's up guys, hey Studio 3.0, we're in the game room today. This video is for the Nintendo Switch gamers out there and this, this is that one accessory that is a must have and I feel like it needs its own video so stick around. Now before we kick it off, you know what to do. If you like content as such and like to support me, please click on the subscribe button and ring that bell to be notified on my upcoming videos. Now I do like to travel and take my switch everywhere I go and sometimes running out of battery could be painful. This accessory I'm going to talk about today is definitely a game changer for me, especially when it's something to do with my power and battery life. Now the Nintendo Switch battery isn't poor, but it cannot realistically deliver more than 3 hours of playtime when it is tasked with running graphically intensive titles. Of course it's fun when you're using the system while commuting to work and back on the bus or train, but when it comes to long trips or situations where plugging the system in is not possible, then you're in trouble. The Nintendo Switch dock itself is certainly not the most well-designed piece of tech. Sliding the switch in and out can be painful and having that pointless front plate, it doesn't let you see the screen when it's connected. Till recently in March, Benham announced this beauty which blew me away from functionality, quality and looks. Guys, this is the Venom Power Pack and Stand. This retails for about 70 Australian dollars and let me tell you, this is by far one of my favorite accessories on the Nintendo Switch. The first thing you notice when you hold this in your hand is it feels like it's a very well made product. Many of these type of accessories can feel a little bit cheap and plasticky, but it feels very nice and solid. And you can tell it's quality build, especially when the Nintendo Switch is slotted inside. In terms of design, it has a smooth black finish. Back of the stand, there are two locking mechanism switches, which when placed in an unlocked position, it allows the top frame of the charging stand to rise for easy access. The top frame also has a cool feature acting as a cooling vent. In the back, you can also see these kickstand legs, which feel like the larger version of the one included on the Switch itself, as well as these awesome blue LED charge level lights, indicating how full the power pack's 10,000 milliamp hour battery is, which also has a cooling vent. Yes guys, 10,000 milliamps. Speaking of charging power, I think I'll sneak in this extra accessory charging dock by Kingston PowerX. <music> This is an amazing product. It charges four Joy-Cons at once and looks awesome. It has a sphere matte black look to it and on top it indicates which controller is charging. This device also has a USB charging port to charge all your other devices, which is pretty cool, as well as Nintendo Switch AC port for charging its battery power using sessions if possible. It also features open cutouts for all console buttons, but funny enough, not a cutout for the console's headphone jack. And of course, this dock does not allow for HDMI cable to be plugged in for the TV use. I use these accessories both in handheld mode and kickstand mode, and I've got to say, I like both experiences. In one hand, the power pack and the stand adds a pleasing weight to the actual console. In partnership with the case's large internal battery, this meant I could play with my controller for hours in comfort without having to worry about the battery dropping out. On that note, the highlight of this device is its large 10,000 milliamp hour rechargeable internal battery. Basically get three hours of your potential game time, which allows me to keep it around the house or in my bag when I'm traveling without a single charge. This product does what it says to do and delivers all the goods. I'm still confused to why the casing does not have headphone jack hole but I can easily customize it by simply drilling a hole and making things work. Overall very impressive product, it helps to elevate Venom's reputation as a quality accessory maker. Well there you go guys, I hope you enjoyed the video, the game room is slowly coming together and once it's finished I'll do a tour video for you guys. Let me know what you guys think of this accessory, if you'd like to see more content like this one give it a thumbs up and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace. Oh,